So this is experiment number five, children. The fifth sample is given to us and we transfer this sample in the test tube. Alright, like this. We transfer it. And then we add water to it. This is distilled water. This is not a tap water. This is pure form of water which we use in the chemistry, in the labor laboratories and in the hospitals. Okay, This is distilled water. And make a solution. We shake it slightly and then make a solution and we make a solution and divide the solution of the sample given to us in two parts in two parts okay like this and to the first sample part of the sample we put sodium hydroxide first drop by drop and then in excess you can see that what do you observe? A dirty green precipitate is formed, which turns reddish brown after some time. Okay, it will take some time. So it will turn reddish brown if you keep it undisturbed for some time. The precipitate is insoluble. You can have a look in excess of sodium hydroxide that is that was added just now. It is insoluble in it. So we can say that ferrous ions are present in the sample given to us. Now to the next part of the sample we add few drops of ammonium hydroxide. And again you can see the precipitate Dirty green precipitate is formed. Now it is, we add some more of ammonium hydroxide and it is insoluble in it. A dirty green precipitate is formed which is insoluble in ammonium hydroxide. You can have a look. Now what do we confirm with this experiment? We confirm that ferrous ions are present in the sample given to us.